The most important part of my practice is about patience. What is going to give me the two things or help me waste the least possible the two things I cannot buy, which is health and time? Yes. Let's talk about health. Uh, Ergonomics is the first thing that the 3D will bring to me. Is it allows me to actually be able to practice better ergonomics than the microscope can, the, the regular microscope. And the 2D microscope in itself was already a big step compared to not having a microscope. But here, the 3D was another step in itself. Why? Because it allowed me to free myself up from looking into the binoculars. And now I don't have to do that anymore. Why? Because I can look at the screen that's in front of me. And not only me, my whole team can actually have access to what I'm doing right now. Not only we have ergonomics, not only we have team effort and teamwork, everybody's having a sense of what's going on around them, which is also another uh, part of the, the whole, this whole um, expert uh, experience that we provide to the, the patient. Now the time, of course when we are talking time, we're talking about efficiency. And the 3D microscope allows me to accomplish that goal, that goal very, very um, specifically. We are collaborating. We're able to see high magnification without losing control of our surroundings. Now, I don't have to be passing instrument back and forth, being locked in the microscope. I truly am able to do that without actually losing track of what I'm doing, but yet I'm still seeing my hands move. We're using our vision just like we would use it in reality. Whereas the 2D microscope, you would be looking through binoculars, and I can tell you that's not what we do in, in real life. You don't look at life through binoculars. You just look at life with your eyes, and um, therefore the answer is straight. Learning curve is simpler with the 3D microscope. It's phenomenal. The depth of view allows me to um, not only it's magnified, it allows me to still keep that depth of view that you wouldn't have on a... If, if a regular microscope was projected on a regular screen, you would lose that depth uh, of perception. And of course, if in a field like dentistry where details matter and there's depth at different levels, then this plays a tremendous role. People see this piece of equipment and the first thing you can either hear or see in their eyes is, is astonishment. And I think that's what we experts should actually get from our patient. We will compare as much as possible the 2D to the 3D, but to a certain point the 3D will be a 3D and the 2D will be a 2D. And both will still exist, I believe, because there is a tier of service that each will provide to different types of providers. While I teach root camp, there are live demonstrations. And this is a perfect tool for the doctors who attend the course to still follow the case as if they were seen through my eyes. To be honest with you, when I first heard of the 3D microscope, I was kind of doubting because we see so many things we hear so many things about technology. But then it took me to be at a show and seeing it, and then realize this is it. So the reason why I selected Siler is multifold. And the number one reason is I always look at track record. So, and I, I didn't know this by the way at first, but I, as I did more research, I realized Siler isn't just in dentistry. Siler isn't just in medical. Siler is in aerospace. Siler is in military. So when the government contracts with a company, billions and billions for optical products, then I know there's some homework I don't have to do. So right there, that was the first reason. The second reason is Siler has been in the microscope industry for a while. But people could say, well, Zeiss and others have been in the industry for a while. And that's true. But then it comes down to 
what is going to get me to my end result. And if my end result is serving my patients with expertise, then I need something of quality, but also I need something that's reasonably priced. And I think that's where Cider found its sweet spot. There are four main reasons why I went with 3D, um, the Cider 3D microscope. Number one is resolution. We all want the best resolution possible. Number two is that the technology offers 60 frames per second, which is extremely high. And then third is there's no latency. And what it means is that what you're doing, you're seeing it instantaneously on the screen. And that's important. I mean, I don't want to be doing something here. And then what I see is kind of delayed. And then the biggest part, and it's the part where people are not so familiar with 3D don't really realize this, is that the screen or the monitor is in an optimal position and it stays with you. So wherever so you're moving the microscope, right? it's staying with the microscope. Okay, don't leave me, don't and leave me behind. when I compare okay. that to competitors, the screen is somewhere else and the clinician has to track down the screen and by doing that is to eventually look at the screen at any angle possible and that will affect the quality of the image. The 3D microscope is an excellent weapon, but it will take time to be trained, and there is a, a learning curve, but I can tell you that this is gonna project whoever wants to go down this path, it's gonna project them way forward because of the ability to see and therefore to make very, very well-informed decisions.